Where are your kids at? No kids. You got some kids? Uh, no. Are you arresting me, sir? If she doesn't step out here right now, I'm going to arrest both of you. I don't have anything on you. Yeah, you do. What is that? The fact that you're stepping on it, you fucking idiot. I'm going to jail? You're going to jail. For what? For child neglect, paraphernalia, and destruction evidence. On September 14th, 2022, shoppers at a Florida Walmart witnessed two small children wandering around the parking lot in the rain, wearing only diapers and nearly being hit by passing vehicles. Witness noticed Dijon Killingbeck asleep behind the wheel of his car with children's items in the back seat. They attempted to wake him up but were unsuccessful. Deputies showed up to see why a responsible adult was nowhere to be found. I believe the Sir, they're not responding in there. He's not responding. The kids ran out of the vehicle and uh, they're half naked. Which vehicle? This yeah, one right here. Clothes. It looks like you got him dressed. Awesome. We got the children's clothes. Okay. I tried to check on him, ask him if he needed medical attention. He's drooling out of his mouth. Eyes rolling in the back of his head. Yeah, I'm in contact. Sir! There's a straw in his pocket as well. You guys don't need me anymore. You guys have a good day. Yeah, it's The car's on. Yeah, and the vehicle's right. Yeah, I got you. Okay, have a good day. <coughs> hey, wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Hey! What are you doing? Right. Step out. What Step out. Step what? out. Step out. Step out. Where are your kids at? No kids. You got some kids? Uh. No? They're not his kids? Step out. There's baby clothes in the Step car. over. Who else you have in the car with you? Uh, Who else was in the car with you? What happened? Listen to what I just asked you. You know who I am? Yeah. You remember me? Yeah. All right. Who else is in the car with you? That girl. Okay. And her kids, right? Yeah. Okay. Where's the girl at? I'm not in no trouble, right? We're determining that. We gotta find mom. The kids in there? They have the kids, yep. Are the kids in there? No, the kids are not in your car. They got out of your car. You're running loose in the driveway here. Don't walk away. Don't walk away. We're just gonna hang out right here. I'm going to jail. We're trying to figure this out. Walk over here to my car. We're getting out of the rain. Walk over here. Mm. Who's your friend? She should be in there? Alright, hang out right here. Are those her kids? Are those her kids? I know who you are. Yeah. We're going to hang out for a second. I'm going to jail? You're not going anywhere. I need to figure out where mom's at. Call her again. Hey, where's the kids? I'm having radio issues, dude. Where's the kids? The kids are over there. Mom's allegedly inside. What's this for? Huh? What's this? What's what? Bro, you were passed out in the fucking car. We were calling you for a little bit. Kids, uh, where are the kids? They're over there. You seen them? They're right there with the other deputy. Oh, they they in there with the other deputy. Where is she on the phone? Is she on the phone? Yeah. Have her step out now. Step out now. Let's get under this little awning. Nope, over here by this thing and have a seat. These guys are going to check on you. 
Make sure you're okay. I see him checked out. Okay. What happened, man? I was just waiting for the girl to come out. You sleeping? She's inside? Yeah. Uh, Are you arresting me, sir? If she doesn't step out here right now, I'm going to arrest both of you. Does that make sense to you? I'm worried about these fucking kids. Get her out. I have to get you checked out, bro. Just chill out. Let them do their job. How are you feeling today? I'm alright. Okay, what's today? Mm -hmm. No, can't look at your phone. Can't look at your phone. I need you to tell what's me. It? What month is it? Don't look at your phone. December. Oh, okay. So what happened today? You got so much gloves on. Oh, well, he's got drugs on. Oh, yeah? He's a he does. They're in his pocket. Right? He doesn't know I know. You have to hurry up. Why do I have to hurry up? No, I'm telling you, the girl. Is she on the phone? Yeah. Okay, so we're checking your vitals. What did you see? Where's Somewhere inside. She's not She better. We're figuring it out. He's talking to mom right there. You want to go to the hospital? All right. You going to jail? I just asked you if you want to go to the hospital, right? Yeah. Do you want to go to the hospital or not? No. Okay. Sure. We're figuring it out. You're more concerned about going to jail than you are these fucking kids, right? Ain't they with mom? No, they weren't with mom. They were with you. Okay? So I'm figuring it out. I thought you said they were shooting another deputy. No. They went with Walmart staff after they ran in the parking lot in nothing but a diaper. While you were sleeping at the steering wheel, right? So for now, put your hands behind your back. Stop walking around. This ain't fair. How ain't it fair? Oh my god. Come on. Can I get my ID out the car? <coughs> we'll work on it. I gotta take a pinch. Okay. Lean up against here. Open your legs up. More. More. Little more. I just left my ID in her car. You just left your ID in her my car? Passport. Okay. Take your fucking hand out of your pocket. Joe? You're being secured right now. If you keep walking off of this car, bro. I don't have anything on me. Yeah, you do. What is that? The fact that you're stepping on it, you fucking idiot. You gonna grab that real fast? I know it's there, sorry. Okay. <laughs> Stop do, fucking moving, Do not dude. do that. Do not do that with me. Step in the car. Mike? Yeah. Stop with your Stop with the pocket. There's nothing in there. Step in. Keep going. I don't know. This is what he had in his. No, it's a straw. He had it in his pocket when I opened, when the door was open. Uh, I'm gonna go take a peek at the car and see if anything's in plain view. All right. Well, this was in plain view while he was in the car. Oh. Who is he to you? He's just your neighbor. Yes, and he has helped a lot. My husband is never home, uh -huh. so he's come over and he's helped. You know, be an extra set of eyes, an extra set of hands. So I asked him, will you please try to Walmart with me because they're wild, they're, they're toddlers, they're 11 months apart, and just sit in the car with the kids while I do a return. It should take That's me your car? Yes. I said it should Why was he in the driver's seat? Oh, I don't know. He was in the passenger seat when I went inside. Okay. He was in the driver's seat? I just said he was, yeah. I'm, so, I'm sorry. I'm, just, I'm really confused because I literally 
expected to go in, do a return. They were both sound asleep, strapped in, taking a nap. I thought by the time I came back out, they'd still be asleep, and I'd go home on my merry way. Like, mm -hmm. this is shocking to me. Okay. Right. I can definitely tell you it doesn't look good. No, I know. Trust me, I understand. Mm -hmm. I know. Um, anybody get the children's names? Yes, they did, and their birthdays. Oh, I said, they're my entire life. I don't have to say, oh, mom, I don't do. You mind rolling up your sleeves for me? Yes. I am 100% sober. November 24th, 2017. So that's your car? Yes. Do I have permission to search your car? I'm going to have you fill out a statement. Here's my question. Listen to what I just said. I'm going to have you fill out a statement saying everything that you just said. All right? Okay? You okay with that? All right. Give me a second. What was your question? What if he tossed something in my car? Where was he seated in the car when you guys came here? He was in the passenger seat. So he's in the passenger seat? He's in the driver's seat. Here's your reality, okay? Is that I'm searching your car regardless. No, I'm okay. Not, I'm not, I, I understand. Just listen, just listen, gonna, listen gonna, to what I'm telling you. Gonna I'm going to search your car regardless because I saw him in your car with paraphernalia. All right? So he's in your car with narcotics as it is. That gives me probable cause to search your car. Please, okay? yeah. Okay? So I'm asking you if you're okay with it, but I really don't need you to be okay with it. No, I'm going to search your okay car. If I determine anything belongs to him, he's going to take it. If I determine anything belongs to you, you you're going to take it. You Does that make sense? Yes. Okay. Not. Let me get you a statement. Shut up, dude. I'm not talking to you right now. I'm going to gym. <coughs> I'll tell you in a minute. What'd you do with your phone? It's in my girl's car. You just had it when you called her. Yeah, and after you put the cuffs on me. Then what happened? Excuse me? Then what happened? With the phone. I don't know what happened. Maybe you left it on that gurney. Oh, fire? Yeah, maybe. Put your feet back in the car. Yeah, go get in contact with Fire Seed. They got his phone. Huh? You get your feet back inside this car. Shut the door. Where are you going, Put your side? feet over there. You're under arrest right now, yeah. Did he come back with that now? I haven't tested it, but he's going to jail for the no neglect either way. Huh. I tried fentanyl first. Huh? I tried fentanyl. Oh, 100%. <laughs> uh, Yellow as fuck. Yep. Looks like fentanyl to me. He's getting destruction of evidence, too. Though. Why? What happened? Because I saw the straw in his pocket. And I took him over here, he took it out and threw it on the ground and tried to fuck. Um, something that you may want to try, uh, since we have a good idea that he was snorting it, uh, take a look up his nose, mm -hmm. look for powder, and if there's powder, see if he'll let you swab. Yeah, I think he lost his phone. All right, man, I'm going to read you something. Fire has your phone. All right, they're going to work on getting it for you. You have the right to uh, remain silent. Do you understand all your rights as I have explained them to you? That means I'm going to jail. Did you understand all your rights as I have explained them to you? Not really. But all right, here we go again. You have the right to remain silent. Do you understand that? Yeah. You don't have to talk to me if you don't want to. Uh, <laughs> anything you say can be used against you in court. Anything you say is going to be brought up in court. Do you understand that? All right. You have the right to talk to a lawyer for advice before you ask, before we ask you any questions and have them with you during questioning. You can ask for a lawyer before I talk to you. Do you understand that? Okay. Okay. Um, if you cannot afford a lawyer, one will be appointed before any questioning if you wish. As in, if you don't have any money, they'll get you a lawyer. Do you understand that? Okay. Um, Is if, that you, my phone? if you decide to answer questions without a lawyer present, you still have the right to stop answering any time until you talk to a lawyer. So what that means is if you start talking to me and you feel uncomfortable, you can ask for a lawyer and questioning stops. Do you understand that? Yeah. With that in mind, do you understand all your rights as I've explained them to you? I'm going to jail. Do you understand all your rights as I have explained them to you? Uh, not really. Okay. <laughs> not really. <laughs> no, you, no, hey, the other thing you so, said is you Uh, he's high. So, um, just try to be as specific as you can. Thank you. Do you want to try to see if he'll let you? There's about a tiny little bit of powder on his nose, like right here. Hold on one second. We're working on your phone. Look up. Look up. Look up. There's something under your chin. Look up. 
Alright. Right. 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 You got a little powder right here. Do you mind if I swab that? Don't f up. It's fine. It's fine. There's nothing there. Alright. Don't f touch your face. Alright, I appreciate that. Thank you. There's nothing there. Okay. That's Destruction what? evidence. What did he say? Oh, <laughs> what did he say? White there's nothing there. It's fine. We saw it was there. I didn't even think. I didn't even, saw it. I didn't even think about that. It's like, it's, like a few, it. it's like a few grains. Yeah. I didn't even think about that. It starts the having your vicious man. I got him for the straw anyway. We both saw him trying to cover it up. Oh, yeah. Well, yeah. He, he was, he was, I had the point. He's like, I ain't got nothing. I was like, you're standing on top yeah. of it. <laughs> yes. Yes. You want to go in there? Yeah, your car's fine. Yeah. He didn't drop anything, nothing. Not that I saw. Okay. Not that I saw. Right. I just want to make sure Yep, clear. yep. My apologies. That's okay. No worries. Thank you so much. Yep. yep. What? I didn't understand. I said, do you want her to take your hat? And my phone? Your phone's here now. I have it. So what? I'm going to jail? You're going to jail. For what? For child neglect, paraphernalia, and destruction evidence. All right, watch your foot. Watch your foot. Give him my hat. Give her your hat? Alright. You don't have to. Yeah, that's not a big deal. I'll hold on to it. Yeah, that's fine. Can I talk to my friend? She doesn't want to talk to you. Watch okay. your knee. Do you want to talk to her? No, I do not, okay. sir. I'm sorry. Right. Child neglect? Yep. All felonies? No. Not all of them. What is it? Well, I'll tell you here in a minute. She really don't want to talk to me no more? Not right now. Did you have a report about me? All done? Yes, sir. I think I, I, think I got everything that you had asked. I'm sorry, I had kindergarten. You're perfectly fine. Now you get a McDonald's. I will get you a McDonald's. Yay! Where's the Happy Meal? I want chicken nuggets. Right here? Yep. Whether or not you want to press charges. I'm sorry, I don't play with my Nope, you're perfectly fine. Sign down here. Right here. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm just like feeling all these emotions mad, angry, You're good. sad, and just... Take your time. Something very bad could have happened, and they're apologizing to me like it's their fault, and I am telling them, you shouldn't have gotten out of the car, but that's just not your fault. Yep. It is not. You're absolutely right. Raise your right hand. Do you swear from that all this is true to the best of your knowledge? Yes, sir. Fantastic. You're free to go. Thank you. Where are we going? You're going to jail, bro. Did she help me? Be honest. Nobody's going to help you. You said no one's going to help me? Not in this situation. You're going to go to jail for this. Can she help me out with anything? No. She wants to hurt me? She can't help you out. Well, take me to the hospital. I'm taking you to the district office. I feel sick. Okay. They gave you the wrong phone. They got to come give us the, new, the right phone. They gave us the wrong phone? Yeah. What felonies is on me? The child neglect and the destruction of evidence. Sir, there's boogers in my nose. Okay. That wasn't the destruction of evidence I'm talking about. What is? When you tried to hide the straw. That wasn't even mine. Yes, it was. We saw it in your pocket. It's on camera. He's got shit up his ass. He's trying to go to the bathroom and shit. So he's asleep right now. I'm trying not to wake him up before I get him to jail. Yeah, no. Yeah. It's up there. Sir, please, could I get home? Yeah. You'll be able to get out. Get out? Get out of jail. Jail? We already discussed this, man. You go in jail. Please, no. Yeah, you can go home. Huh? You can go home. Go home? Yep. Seriously? Yeah. From where? From the f jail after you bond out. Oh my god. So the kids got got back to their mom. So what, what kind of charge is that for me? I told you. What? Child neglect. Neglect? So no kidnapping, just child neglect, right? Why would you get hit with kidnapping? Just asking you, I'm just saying. No, no kidnapping. That's a felony too. What's a felony? Child neglect. Child neglect is a felony. So how many felonies I got tonight? <clears throat> Three. What's 
does it. There's two kids. Mr. Wetback, I'm going to go ahead and give you a warning. If you try to dump anything in this toilet, we're going to find out. Dump what in the toilet? Uh, anything. Anything. Don't let it. Give me a warning. Yes, he gave you a warning. Fair warning. I should go home? No. What? You got. You don't like me too much, right? What? You don't like me too much, right? I don't know you. You do know me. I don't know you like that. You're going to harass me for the past few. Put this hand on top of your head. Did you lose those kids today or did we? So the girl's not happy with me neither, right? Uh, I don't know her. I don't know her. She didn't seem too pleased about you losing her kids, no. Dijon may not have been these children's father, but law enforcement certainly didn't let him off the hook. Dijon racked up five charges, including two counts of felony child neglect, felony destruction of evidence, possession of drug paraphernalia, and driving with a suspended license. He pled no contest to two counts of child neglect and drug paraphernalia charges and was sentenced to 29 days in county jail, 24 months of probation, and $569 in court fees. Dijon has had plenty of run-ins with the law, with charges including battery of a person 65 years of age or older, trespassing after warning, resisting arrest without violence, and cannabis possession. The unnamed mother of these children, who relied on Dijon to watch her kids while she did her shopping, did not get in any legal trouble for this situation. Some might say she was just as negligent in taking care of her children as Dijon was. Do you think this was all Dijon's fault, or did she also deserve to catch a charge? Leave your opinion in the comments. Thank you for watching Cop Cam Nation. Be sure to like and subscribe for more juicy content. You don't like me too much, huh? Eh?